What's going guys, it's Death Monkey. Today we're going to be talking about some rather interesting information concerning the Call of Duty Black Ops 6 beta. So as you guys can see, courtesy of Detonated, which is owned by DK Dynamite, uh, we've actually found out that uh, there was a recent uh, leak that was um, showcased online, apparently of a basically UK gamer who managed to basically pre-order Black Ops 6. And there's some rather interesting information coming from one of the receipts that he received. So, for those who don't know, the Black Ops 6 multiplayer beta begins later this summer following the Call of Duty Next reveal event. Call of Duty just announced that content creators will be playing Black Ops 6 multiplayer live from the Call of Duty Next reveal event similar to previous years. Unsurprisingly, Game UK leaked the starting dates for the Black Ops 6 multiplayer beta. So here's everything we know so far. During the Black Ops 6 Direct event, Activision confirmed that Call of Duty Next will be indeed be happening for a third time later this year. Players will likely get to see a full reveal of Black Ops 6 multiplayer, Zombies, and possibly Warzone during the livestream. In recent years of Modern Warfare 2 and 3, the beta for multiplayer began around 24 hours after the conclusion of the Call of Duty Next event. This year, things may be slightly different for Black Ops 6 multiplayer. An image from the store Game UK surfaced which confirms the following dates for the Black Ops 6 beta. Early closed beta going from August 28th through September the 3rd, and an open beta to be determined. So this came from Bob Network UK. So as you guys can see, um, he's actually got uh, some rather interesting information. And as you guys can see, circled in red reads the 20 closed pre-order beta is 28th of August, most likely after that it says 3rd of September. So that's really interesting there, guys. Let me know what you guys' views and opinions are that in the comments box down below. The early close beta is for use who have pre-ordered an edition of Black Ops 6, like me, so I've done the Vault Edition for those who don't know, or for those who are subscribed to Xbox Game Pass, considering how long the early close beta is. It's unclear if some of those days are also for the open period, or if there will be a second weekend for those who did not pre-order. As confirmed by Phil Spencer, the Black Ops 6 beta will be available for all platforms at the same time, marking the first time there isn't console exclusivity to a particular period of the beta itself. It's fair to assume the beta will go live in just a few hours or less after the Call of Duty Next event comes to a close. Now, for those who don't know, um, basically Microsoft earlier this year basically managed to purchase Activision. So basically, even though they purchased Activision doesn't mean to say that there will be Xbox ex exclusivity, per se. Um, basically, there's going to be no exclusivity as far as beta is concerned. So, that's kind of interesting. Let me know what you guys' views and opinions are of that. The beta download, just saw, just as we saw for titles like MW2 and 3, players should be able to begin preloading the multiplayer beta the same week as the Call of Duty Next reveal event. The download should appear for all platforms around the same time during the week of August 28th. Uh, for those who don't know, the download likely won't be more than 25 gigabytes, as that was a ballpark file size for recent Call of Duty beta packs. As far as Xbox Game Pass beta support, a fair amount of confusion has circulated regarding how pre-orders and beta access works for Xbox Game Pass subscribers. To clarify, players will get access to the Black Ops 6 beta if they are subscribed to either Game Pass Ultimate, Game Pass PC, or Game Pass Core with their Game Pass console tier. Uh, so that's really interesting for those who don't know at the end of one of the trailers there was mention of Black Ops 6 coming to Xbox Game Pass Day 1. Players will also get access to the Frank Woods upgrade skins for use in Modern Warfare 3 and Warzone if they are subscribed to the Game Pass. So that's really interesting to think about there guys. Let me know what you guys views and opinions are this in the comments box down below. So we don't have any, these are not set dates at this present moment in time, however, the, going from the information that we got from Game UK, I think we can more or less safely assume that this happens to be the dates that we're going to expect to play uh, Black Ops 6 early. So let me know what you guys' views and thoughts are, make sure you guys like and subscribe, hit the notification button so it's an upload, and I'll see you in the next one. Till then, peace out.